Look, guys, finally, I have a working toilet. <laughs> I'm so happy. It's been since April. <laughs> I don't have to leave here whenever I need to go. Yay. Yeah, the guy that installed it, uh, he said the floor's fine. There's joists, joists underneath right there that are still good and everything, so. Thank goodness I didn't have to replace the floor. I used, I put, yesterday I put down that Gorilla. Well, I'll show you. Show you the stuff I used. I've got two tubes because I thought I'd need it. And I only ended up needing one. It's wood filler. I don't know if I showed it to you before. I might have. But he said he'd never heard of it. And he said it works good. <laughs> yep. It's not leaking, so thank God. There's no leaks. And oh, he found a leak underneath the sink, too. He went ahead and fixed that. It was that sprayer thing. So he just took it out of there. I've never used those things. Never had a desire to use a sprayer. Oh, and the uh, junk man uh, came and got the refrigerator for scrap. And look at that. And my mommy, bless her heart, she wanted the refrigerator to be even with the counter, right? She didn't want it to stick out a little bit. So she had them push it up against the wall. You guys have ever seen anything like that before? <laughs> and it won't come off. I cleaned that wall. I got the rest of that border off and cleaned the wall so I can paint it. Because I want to paint it before the other refrigerator goes back in. I'm not just shoving a refrigerator back in there. <laughs> Homie don't play that. But I put the new seat on myself. He had to run and get a brass fitting for that, to fix that uh, sprayer thing. And um, I put the seat on while he was gone. I'd done that before. I'd replaced the toilet seat before, so. I knew how to do it. <laughs> but I'm so happy. I have a toilet. Next is to put the floor down. Uh, I still gotta go tomorrow and get the uh, the kills. Somebody told me about kills. Oh, Craig Sr. And then somebody else said, yes, it was good too. Uh, shoot, the female. Oh, crap. I can't think of who it was right off right now, but thank you. Thank you too. You know who you are. <laughs> thanks, Craig. And thanks. Uh, somebody else said it was really good too. The kills. I heard of it. Now, the spray I got, I don't think it was made by Kiehl's, but it was for tub and shower. But it's just too, it's too, too much, too hard. And like I said, it would have took like probably five more cans. So I'm going to run and get that, finish that. That'll look so much better. And then I got to put the floor down, put the trim down around the floor. Oh, I got a new dryer vent too. I got to clean that out from the outside. Well, inside and outside. I got a new dryer vent. You can just get the drywall. But I'm so happy. Both things happened the same day, too. The, I posted on uh, Facebook. It's called the Barnesville Liars Bench on Facebook. And you just post things on there that you might need or you're looking for somebody to do something. And I posted yesterday um, that I needed somebody to come haul away a old refrigerator and man I got like three people right away but I was over here working I was playing Pandora and I never you know notifications go off I just think well somebody on YouTube or whatever I never stop my what I'm doing and check them so I didn't check till I got home and I thought oh my gosh I missed these people so uh I got back in touch with the the one guy and I thought he was first I felt bad he, he was a notification that came in after I got home, and I didn't, I just looked at it, and I just saw his, because, you know, it came in, and then, I, and then I picked up the phone and looked, so I didn't think to go back, but there was another guy ahead of him, so I felt bad um, that I didn't hit him back first. But anyways, he came, and he, and he got the fridge out of here, so now my floor got tracked, <laughs> but that's okay. <laughs> So now, um, Jed can bring the refrigerator. So yay, that got accomplished today. He came, 
Let's see, the, t the scrap man came at 10 after 10. I got here at 10. He came at 10 after 10. And then uh, the plumber said he'd be here in the afternoon. Well, he was here at 11. And then he just now left. I don't know what time it is. What, two, two something, three maybe? Yeah, he had to cut, you know, he had a sawzall. He had to cut the flange off, and he had to go downstairs and cut pipe down there, too, in the basement. And then he had to do the snake on top of that, but, and he put a new handle on the toilet. So that was good. Yay, finally. <laughs> See, I think I did. I'll show you guys when I finished painting that because I forgot that piece at the very bottom. <laughs> so I got that done. I still got to paint the knobs white. So, yeah. Nice. <laughs> I'm so happy that I have a working toilet. <laughs> Things are getting done. All right, guys, I'm going to jump off here because I don't think I have anything to do. Now I just got to go get more paint. I have to get, you know, I have to finish this trim in the kitchen. And I have to paint the wall where the fridge goes. But I'm going to leave it sticking out, you know. If I don't want it. I don't, you should never put the coils of your refrigerator right against the wall, ever. Because they need to breathe. You need to have to clean them, you know. You gotta dust them. You just don't, it's not good practice to do that. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Oh, I brought some things over here. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> I figure every time I come over here, I might as well bring some boxes with me, right? There will be less boxes we have to haul on the 30th. So, a couple pictures. <laughs> this is the first thing I bought, that cook right there. That's the first thing I bought to decorate the house. And then I bought that basket to go on back of the toilet. It hides that little chip in the tank. Plus, you know, I could put the toilet paper in there for now. I have a standing toilet paper holder. It holds like three... Uh, rolls of toilet paper and then it has the one you hook on the spin on the so you can spin it I don't like the ones that are mounted to the wall anyways I have that so I'm gonna bring it over oh I think I'm gonna pick up a new faucet too for this wish I'd have had that because he'd have done it he was like what well, you want me to do anything else want me to do anything else <laughs> And I was like, I was like, well, what's the damage? He said, oh, I'll let the boss man bill ya. So who knows? He's a friend of Dwayne's. Yeah, that'd be nice. <laughs> I'd probably get a bill. <laughs> and I didn't use, need this. He used his. He said, take that back. He said, that's like $9 a can or something. I said, I don't, know. I don't remember what I paid for it, but. I don't think I have the receipt. I told him to keep it. He said, no. He said, you might need it. Just keep saving. So I'm finally going to take the, I labeled them. I took a, put kitchen, living room, bathroom. I'm finally going to take the switches, the face plate, face plates, switch plates, you know, for those things. I'm finally going to take them home, wash them really good with uh, Dawn. I guess I could do it. Well, no, I don't got hot water yet because the gas isn't turned on. They can't come. Their first time to come, I think, is the 15th, maybe? I want to say the 15th. I have it wrote down at home. So they have to turn the gas on because the hot water heater is gas. So the furnace, the stove, the hot water heater is gas. And then you have the electric and the water. But uh, when I get that stove from Jed, it's electric, so he said he'd wire it up, so that'll be nice. So I'll just have the hot water heater. If I ever get a new hot water heater, I mean, if I have to ha get a new hot water heater, um, I don't know how old that one is, I can't remember. 
But if I have to get one, I'm getting electric too. I don't like gas hot water heater. I guess the gas furnace will have to stay.